We got about 60 guys came through the program. You know what I'm saying? Easy day, easy day. Three guys on every team minimum. Come to JLT, you get right. You guys have a different tax bracket. I know what time it is. Yes, sir. My name is Jamal Ligon, and I'm a performance coach here at JLT Performance Gym, located in Hollywood, California. I'm ready. Huh. I've been training for about 15 years now, working with a wide range of NFL athletes. All right, here we go. Ooh, ooh. There we go. Nice. Our off-season program is unlike anything you've ever seen. We incorporate running, lifting, vision, coordination, balance, all into one package. The mindset is to excel. Quick, 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 quick. It's to get faster. It's to get stronger. These tennis balls built this place. So when it's time to pack it up and head back to camp, my guys are ready to outcompete everybody. Hurry up, hurry up. We call it the off season, but in my world, there is no off season. What's up, man? As a performance coach, I have to be at 100%, just like my athletes. Let's go to work. Let's go to work. Come on. My guys are out there working their butts off on the field, in the gym, day in and day out throughout this program. I have a responsibility to them to also take care of my body and make sure I'm getting the proper amounts of rest and sleep to match that level of preparation and intensity. Every morning, I wake up, make myself a cup of tea, do my morning meditation, and lace up for the grind ahead of me. When I leave, I'm as ready as my players are. We have about four to six weeks to get these guys ready for training camp. It's my job to mentally and physically prepare them for this level of competition. And it all starts at the JLT Performance Gym. JLT Performance is a 4,000 square foot state-of-the-art facility. We have 30 yards of indoor turf where we do all of our mobility and speed work. A full weight room where we can work on power, strength, and explosiveness. Keep the chest up. Yep, yep, yep. You got that. We have curved treadmills for all our conditioning. 11, 10, 9. And a recovery center where we have in-house physical therapy, massage services, and chiropractic services. This is where we can work on all the guys' injury prevention needs. And to top it off, we have a full hydration center where clients can hydrate and receive protein shakes after their workout. 14, 13, 12, 11, 10. Nine, eight. It's high intensity. The thing that makes Jamal's NFL offseason program the best is it's the closest you're going to get to what you're going to get throughout the season. You know, this is the most important time for us as professional athletes going into training camp. It gets your body acclimated and conditioned to perform at the highest level and it just makes you want to come in and, and be your best every single day. First and goal from the seventh. Murray and wide open and making the catch. Christian Kirk, touchdown. One of the things that makes JLT so unique is that we get out of the gym. We get a chance to hit the beach, we get a chance to go to the track, and we're also in the pool on recovery days. It's a great way to kind of diversify our training and it still makes it fun. Monday, we're at the field. Sometimes we're working on the track. This is the day where we kind of get a chance to open up the guys and work on that cardio and endurance training. Out of here. Oh. You gotta keep going, keep going. Right after the field, we come back to the gym, and it's heavy. I like to start at the top of the mountain on Monday. It's the heaviest lift of the week. I get a chance to kill him on the upper body or lower body strength workout. There we go. Nice. Tuesday's a speed day. We're going to work on parachutes, sleds. I'm still going to have guys going through cone drills, but it's all geared for that straight ahead running. Huh. There we go. There we go. All the way through, all the way through, all the way through. Wednesday's a recovery day. Supposed to be their light day, but we're still getting after it. Might take the guys to the pool, or we might just do some vision, hand-eye coordination, balance and mobility work that day. Outside leg tap, reverse tap, and I'm stepping through that hole to get here. Thursday's a lateral or multi-directional speed day. We're gonna be doing a lot of drills where they're moving east and west on the field. Still working on parachutes. Maybe it's a back pedal. It's just a day where they're not running straight ahead. Four. Get out of there. After that, we're right back to the gym, and we're gonna still work on that lower body or upper body strength workout. Woo! Good lift, good lift, good lift. And then Friday is my signature JLT beach day. Santa Monica's sun is beaming down on us. This is where I get to do a lot of our field stuff on sand. 
We like to get the guys out of their natural environment because when we take them back to the field, they start noticing that they can push off a little harder laterally. They got a little bit more burst because the sand doesn't let you get that. It kind of holds you back while you're training. So it's over, come back down home, up, back home okay. to green. So All right. There we go. Good step. Boom! Oh my God, I even gotta watch. Friday's my tennis ball specific day because I can mess them up on that sand. React, don't anticipate. Hop in, warm it up. We're giving them a 360 degree look at different workouts in different ways to challenge their body. Three, two, go. Oh, I lost, I lost. I lost. Damn! We have a lot of unique drills here at JLT that are I would like to say they're the staple of our training program. The tennis ball drill is by far my favorite, and I think everyone who comes here, favorite drill. The drill that I'm always looking forward to is the JLT special, the tennis ball drill. The tennis ball drill is just a drill that everybody loves. <laughs> it's a drill where I get to work on the guy's hand-eye coordination, agility, and mental awareness. Oh, you go! <laughs> <laughs> The trick is not to watch the shoulders. What I'm doing with this drill is I'm trying to mess them up. I'm throwing two tennis balls, but they don't know where it's going. Sometimes it might go low, sometimes it might go high. Sometimes I might hit them with a double move to the same side. It gets the competitive juices flowing. Don't watch the shoulders. <laughs> Let's go! I think my best client in the drill might be Odell Beckham Jr. We set the record at almost 75 tennis ball throws. Check it out, guys. We're gonna use the lights today. Right hand red, left hand blue. You see the light, you get to the light. You see the light, you get to the light. It's a very simple game. Go. The Blaze Pies are a unique training tool that works on agility and quickness, but I think the best part about it is it challenges the mind. Nice, there we go. We got one more down, just one more. Sometimes I'm telling them a color to work to, they have to run to that color, figure out what hand to use, what position, so it challenges their mind because if a linebacker's coming at them, they have to make a split decision which way to go, and that's what the lights do. Wow. <laughs> that's what it's about though, baby. Hey, still running with the steel. The recovery part of training is almost more important than the actual physical training. You're not gonna be able to do half these drills if you're not seeing a massage therapist, a chiropractor, getting some type of physical therapy. They had the PTs here also. They had people here that were doing stem, you're doing dry needles, you're doing cupping, you're doing stretching, you're doing massages, get your shakes. Whatever you need is here for you, so you come here, he'll set a plan for you and uh, set you right. The first thing I ask my guys is how much sleep did you get? I need to know that because the drills that I'm taking them through, if you don't get enough sleep, you're not gonna be able to perform these movements. Having enough sleep is mentally and physically preparing you for the workouts here at JLT. A few months ago, I was scrolling on my timeline and I was like, that's one of my guys posting about a bed and some numbers. So when he came in and started training during the off season, I was like, what are you doing? Like, what are you sleeping on? And the first thing they said is, bro, you gotta get this bed. You gotta try to sleep number. So long story short, I got one and I haven't slept this good in a long time. Like, this is a game changer. It's allowed me to kind of monitor how much I'm sleeping. It checks my heart rate and how hot I was, how many times I rolled over and got up. This bed is smart. When I take those midday naps and have to go back for the second NFL group, I got a little bit of a recharge. Yeah, today would be pretty smooth. Did you want to knock out any type of lift that you might have missed, like, you know what I mean? Morning, morning, morning. What's up, man? Here at JLT, it is family and establishing those relationships with guys. And you know, you're training with the best of the best every single day and everybody's here to make you better. It's the experience, it's the family bond, being able to have that camaraderie and the talent that's here. You know, Christian Kirk, Odell Beckham, a lot of my boys from the crib, Stefan Diggs, Ronald Darby, just a bunch of dudes that honestly love the game of football and just want to do their best and get better every day.
It's almost like I'm delivering the cheat code. And what I mean by that is where can you go and train with the people you're going to directly compete against on the other side of the ball? It's a real close-knit group, especially guys that's been here for a while. He, he builds relationships with his guys, not just off of a professional level, but more so like a family, personal level. And to me, I feel like he's a leader, but damn near in the weight room and in this business because he tried to get the best out of you. Woo! Come on, Bussy! Right hand red. Get back, get back, here you go. I think the most satisfying part of my job is being able to see the results. It touches new levels for me because I'm seeing guys go to the Pro Bowl. I'm seeing guys run 4-3 at the Combine. I can't stress how proud I am of each and every single one of my clients.